Massachusetts. The latest national teen pageant champion is Lexington's Lillian Elmore. But the Miss Amazing competition had no bikini contest or primetime TV spot. In fact, you've probably never heard of it. That's because it's solely for those with disabilities. Something in my brain kept saying, you have to do this. And I was like, okay, brain, sure, I'll do this. The journey to that Chicago stage was not easy. The 17-year-old struggles with cerebral palsy. In her words, it's like having a cramp all over your body all the time. I have chronic pain due to like tightness in my back and hamstrings, so that gets a little difficult. But she's advocating instead of complaining, using her new platform to highlight the value of disabled people, as opposed to simply including them, and maintaining an impressive attitude of positivity. Getting people to embrace differences of all kinds of differences, not just disability, is really the magic of what she brings. I have, oh, there are days where I don't, there are days where I allow myself to wallow in that kind of, oh, poor pity me, but if you stick there, you're not going to have any fun. So when her name was the final one called, Lillian Elmore, her dad couldn't help but reflect. You see your child happy, that's all a parent can ask for, is seeing your child smile and, mm. and be happy, and it was beyond words how, how much how great I felt after she won. His little girl far more able than disabled and with a lesson for us all. I have CP and like it's not gonna change and like I just have to use this circumstance no matter how negative or how hard it is as a springboard to help other people. In Lexington, Adam Bagney, WCVB, New Center 5. Oh my. Amazing indeed. Oh my. Yeah. <laughs> that was great, that was great. Someone told me to do it, so I did yes, it, okay. You sure did, Lillian, you sure did. <laughs> That's great.